I mean, had Andrew Jackson been a little bit later, you wouldn't have had the Civil War. He was, he was a very tough person, but he had a big heart, and he was, he was really angry that he saw what was happening with regard to the Civil War. He said, there's no reason for this. People don't realize, you know, the Civil War, um, yeah, was you think about it, why? People don't ask that question. But why was there the Civil War? Why could, why could that one not have been worked out? Well, I'm not sure it's totally true that people don't ask why was there a Civil War. Yeah. It may be one of the major questions asked in all of American history. Joining us now to discuss this is Selena Zito, who did that interview. She's on the phone with us. Also, Doug High, CNN political commentator, former communications director for the RNC. Maria Cardona, CNN political commentator and Democratic strategist. Lynn Sweet, Washington bureau chief for the Chicago Sun-Times. Selena Zito, you were on the phone with us, uh, and you asked the question that got that rather remarkable answer. People don't ask the question, why was there a civil war? What did the president mean there? Do you have any idea? Uh, well, I mean, I can only guess, uh, as I think everybody understands in the way he talks, as he bounces all over uh, in a conversation. So the conversation began before the tapes start rolling, where we were talking about Andrew Jackson and his impact in life in American history and then the interview started and then he you know referenced back to him and he was talking uh, about before the tape was rolling he was talking about sort of you know he wished the Civil War hadn't happened don't we all you know it was it was a very trying time and then we went back to this because he he was looking at the, um, the the portrait of Jackson that's over his left hand shoulder um, when he's sitting at the Resolute desk, 